Can your boy get a fit check right now because I'm feeling pretty fire. What's up guys and welcome back to Ghost of Tsushima. And uh, as you guys can see, we have a pretty major change. This is actually the Sakai clan armor that we unlocked in the last episode. It's just that we upgraded it to level three. So you guys know as we've been playing this game, we'll pick up little packets of like materials and leather and linen and stuff like that. You can use those items to upgrade other stuff in your games, like weapons, your equipment, your bags and pouches and stuff like that. Armor is another one of those things. So I went to town, I got the third tier level of Sakai clan armor here, and you guys could see it looks fresh, but it's also really, really useful. So we've got a major increase to our melee damage, a massive increase to our health, and we increased our standoff streak by one with a 10% chance to terrify nearby enemies. So you guys know we've already completely upgraded our skill for that. So now we're going to be able to take down four people every time we start a standoff just by clicking one button at a time. So uh, pretty insane. I'm excited for this episode. Let's hop into it. So if you guys remember from our last episode, the Yadikawa clan has been... Uh, they're, they're kind of being sieged by the Mongols. They're trying to starve them and stuff. So we're trying to help them out. Come. Help them fight back. I wanted to help Lord Sakai. If I stayed in Yarikawa, I'd be useless. Better useless than dead. We're searching for missing soldiers. You're not trained for this. I can learn. And I won't get in the way. Fine. But be careful. And listen to your sister. Yes, my lord. Any sign of the archers? The locals have seen them in this area. But we haven't. Let's look around. So we're gonna find these these top tier Yarikawa archers that supposedly went off to fight the Mongols and never came back. Who knows? Could have deserted, could have been captured, could have been killed. We're gonna find out. Ah, here we go. Tracks. Footprints. Three, four men. Can you tell where they went? Let's find out. We used to come here to catch crickets. At least once a week. Then we'd weave tiny bamboo cages for them. Do you remember why we came here to catch crickets? No. To get you away from our mother. <laughs> when she was angry and looking for someone to blame. But oh. crickets kept you busy. That's really sad. I don't want to hear that. The tracks lead to we this are house. looking for some archers. Whoa, oh, that's a bear! Okay. I got you. We're gonna be fine. Oh my god! Okay, yeah, we probably... We, we probably want to do a better job of, of dodging, Trev. To be more careful. I will take those hides, we though. Should check the house. I'll look out here. Those Gozan hides are really useful. They've been sleeping here. At least the bear didn't get them. That thing almost killed us. Like, we were... The bear ate most of their food. Maybe that's why I'm still alive. He wasn't hungry. Arrowheads, bowstrings, hide to make adhesive. Nice. The archers must have been here. Jin, Kaka, I found something. What's going on? The firewood is still warm. The archers were staying in the house. They must be close. There they are, heading up the hill toward that bridge. They're staying low for a reason. Keep your heads down and don't call out. You must be the archers from Yarikawa. What's left of them? The Mongols caught us raiding a camp for supplies. We barely got away. What about the others? Captured. We tracked them here. We can help you free them. Hmm. You look like you can handle yourselves. I'm Daikoku. Jin Sakai. Sakai, eh? As long as you're not the Shimura. <laughs> well, have a look at that about that. So we gotta free their guys camp. here. Looks like the Mongols are preparing to move. Headed for a garrison on the other side of old Yarikawa. We need to strike now, before they leave. Yeah, we gotta stop them before they get there. There's your archers. All in good health. The sooner we free them, the better. Good idea to rush in. We know where they're headed. We can set an ambush along the route. The terrain isn't good for an ambush. What about old Yarikawa? Rooftops on both sides of the road. We can even use your stolen explosives. You found that, huh? I like the way you think. Good. All right. Let's move before the Mongols do. So we're setting up an ambush. I love it. Are headed this way. Taka, get inside one of the houses. No. I'm staying out here. I can fight too. Jin, tell him. Taka can decide for himself. 
Then you can watch out for him. Are you scared? No. Not really. A little. Yuna's never afraid. It's all right to be scared, but... You're probably like that, too. Fear drives you to be stronger, fight harder. My father taught me that. I never knew my father. When I get scared, I can't think. I freeze. That's because you lack training. Yuna's been in danger many times. She's had more practice than you. Without her, I'd be dead. So would I. So I can see we've got the, the big set there, and then we've also got a bunch of little Here ones across the way. I'll shoot the barrels when the Mongols get close. Lord Sakai, I'm not ready. You can do this, Taka. Just take your fear and use it. Yes, my lord. Not gonna draw too prematurely not here. Not yet. I'm gonna wait for the right moment. Wait for the middle of the pack. They're close enough now, right? No mercy! Looks like we've got some guys down here. One guy, that is. Is that everyone? No, we've got a couple more up top here. It's a well executed ambush, at least so far. Leader's down, that's what I'm talking about. I was just about to be able to parry and you, you got in the way, dude. There it is. Two leaders down. Nine more to go for our moon stance. Not too shabby. And that was an extremely successful, uh... Not Sakai! Extremely successful ambush right there. Look, Daikoku. Take your men back to Yarikawa stronghold. Right away. I know you're a Sakai. But you didn't mention you're the ghost. We have your help breaking the siege. If Ujimasa accepts it, I'll make sure he does. The stories are true. I've never seen anyone fight like you. The legend lives on, Saka. baby. Go with Daikoku. I need a moment with Jin. I'll see you back home. We did it! Taka could have been killed, Jin. I saw him fall. He's fine. He did everything perfectly. I shouldn't have let him fight. You know, I know you want to protect him, but you're holding him back. Taka's not a fighter. He could become one. You don't know my brother like I do. You can't always be the one to defend him. I'll decide what's best for Taka. You look after your own family. I need to go back. We still need to end this siege. I'll see you there. I love our antlers, bro. It's so sick. They killed the samurai. What chance do a bunch of farmers have? We have to try. This doesn't seem like her. I think you need this more than me. Some sake. Kenji spent the rest of the day wearing one sandal. <laughs> Lots of sake. <laughs> this is terrible. My mother loved it. Used to drink it like water. She gets so mad when she ran out. Yelled at us. Where's my tea? Sounds like a demanding woman. 
she broke Taka's arm when he was six. I took him away. Ran as far from her as we could get. We heard they found her a month later. Face down in the street. You were brave to protect your brother. That's awful. Sometimes, our only choice is to walk away from everything we know. So that's why she is so obsessed with keeping him safe and, and almost up, overprotective. This is it. To the kids. And now we're waking up hungover. <laughs> Whatever happens, we don't retreat. Let's do it. Good, good job, guys. Way to be prepared for this battle. Jin, Yuna, the Mongols. Let's go. How close? They're at the main gates. If they get through, we'll stop them. Save us! Dude, I've got chills. This is so sick. Everybody believes in us. Trusts in us. It's time to go to battle. They'll breach the gate. Stand your ground. Every Mongol who sets foot inside our walls will die. Don't let them pass you. Wait for the right moment, and we can chain assassinate. Assassinate. This is a new ability that we had. We can assassinate three people at once. Run up on this dude. Take him down. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, we got we got big dudes. Okay, he he got us there. Gotta be careful, but we're gonna be fine. We actually we should swap to our wind stance. Wind stance melts through the big dogs. Okay. Guy over here, shield guy. We're gonna want our water stance. Just keep going after him. There we go. Sword guy, we're gonna want a sword stance. And the stone stance, I'm sorry. Back to water stance. We could get our blowgun out. I'm kinda tempted to, to blowgun. But I don't think I don't think we need it. That was actually really clean right there. I'm, I'm proud of the crew. Warriors of Yerikawa, hold this position. Let's see if I can get a chain assassination. Assassinate. Dude, I love it. So sick. He's gone. Our fighting is on another level right now. Fire Archer, not gonna worry about him. We do in fact have to worry about this guy though. Break down his armor. Take him down. These guys are no joke, dude. Got him. Holy cow, they just, they, they aren't stopping. Break through his defenses. Just keep going to work. There it is. Back to this guy. You gotta have all your stances right. You gotta watch out for the people behind you. You also gotta be able to dodge at the right moment. Like this is just, this is just insane. There we go. Just jump right up in there and go to work, baby. I actually feel like we can fight now. I feel like a brand new man out here. That's what I'm talking about. They're falling back. We barely damaged them. What are they up to? Trying to lure us out? Ooh, catapults! No. Hold them off as long as you can, then fall back to the keep. I'll deal with the siege weapons. I should come with you. Trebuchets! No. Tucker needs you. And we're gonna have to take them out. 
On our lines. Break through the bomb line. Destroy those siege weapons. If we move like a ghost, we might be able to here. So the siege weapons are up top. Take him down. Pick some arrows back up. Clear to run across here. Okay. Got more arrow guys up here. Give me a. Uh, give me our blowgun with the hallucination dart. Did not mean to call my horse right there. Just threw his friend off the mountain. Getting an assassination here. Is that dude coming for us? I think we might be good. Okay, that was kind of clean. Dude is right here. But we got the assassination. Nicely done. What do we have up here? Okay. Try to be stealthy. Who else is up here? We're in the siege engines. Well, I was hoping to be a little, a little stealthier than that, but I guess, I guess it's just gonna have to do. Here we go. Nice counter there, Trev. Just go right through him. Whoop. Beautiful counter again. Broke his defense. There it is. All right, so we got to destroy these things. Ah, right here. Give it a little cut. One down. Couldn't see him do anything, but that's fine. I, I trust that he did it. I mean, we got we got lots of guys. I'm gonna. I was gonna say I was gonna go with the, the spear guy first. Would like, would like to kill him very quickly. Just gonna take these last, last couple dudes out here. Break his defenses. Break his spirit. Final guy here. Last swordsman. Break his block. Oh, my goodness. Easier said than done. That's for sure. The second trebuchet down. They broke through the walls. But we can still drive them out. It's not over till the fat lady sinks. It won't be easy to get back to the stronghold. No way. Is our objective just to get to the stronghold? <laughs> or should we take some of these guys out too, is the question. I don't know how we're gonna get up, up over the bridge around these guys. Poison dart? Gonna kill their big guy and scare off the little guys. Or not. Gonna switch back to our bow in case we need it. 
should be able to do a chain assassination here. And we're in. Damn. That's the general, Tamuke. Sounds like he's near the keep. Okay. Got a feeling we might have to fight him in the keep, but I guess we'll see. This new chain assassination upgrade that we got is is incredibly useful. It's the best best ability we have. We upgraded it twice, so we the first one lets you get two at a time, this one lets you get three at a time. I don't know if we're going to be able to kill all these guys assassination style, but I guess I'll go for it. I don't know how nobody hasn't noticed. Noticed this yes, yet, but we'll, we'll take it. Looks like they may have just noticed something. Hit him with the poison dart. I'm really enjoying killing everyone. Like it, 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 it's kind of messed up, but I really, I really enjoy using all the tools at our disposal to just completely mess with these guys. Just mass murder. It's great. Are you kidding me? I hate it when that happens. It's fine though. All right, so we're gonna want the the water stance. Oh no, we want sword stance. My bad. I went to press square to assassinate him, and it it warned him we were there. We're good. Didn't even take any damage or anything. Don't have any blow darts at our disposal anymore. We wasted them all, but. I guess that's all right. Tamuke, face me. The ghost. Kotun will reward me for your aid. If you can get it to him, it's all yours. I am Jin Sakai, and I have killed men like you all across our island. Your blood will soak the island! So he, he's got a double attack there that he, he seems to like. Oof. Yeah, this this hurts. He has a double attack where he goes sword and then shield, or shield and shield and then sword, one of the two. Oh, nicely done, Trev. Way to get behind him. You can't get Kotun's reward if you're dead. There we go. You will not get another. Let's heal up here. So yeah, you gotta you gotta dodge twice, and then I'm hitting him with the overheads to try to break down his blocking. Also, when he doesn't have his his sword on fire, you can you can do a counter attack. You can parry and counter. Dude, these are these battles are just so long and and trying and you, have killed men in many you gotta grind it out. But here, you die. Swords out, we can parry and get some hits in. But then he's gonna put his he's gonna put it back on so we can only dodge and we can't get hits in between. Which means we gotta we gotta do our overhead attack and wear out his blocking. Insane, dude. There's just so much that goes into it. Got his blocking down. This should be. This should be it. There it is. That battle took so long. It's right through the back. Slaughtering leaders earns the ghost stance. What is the ghost stance? Invaders, look at your general. Run. This is your fate. People of Yankawa, hunt every 
Mongol to the last man. Spare no one. <laughs> They're running now. Let's go. Oh, they aren't all running though. I mean, a lot of them are. Holy cow! Kill enough enemies without taking damage to earn ghost stance. So it looks like you got to kill seven enemies without without taking. Oh shoot! We just took damage. Are you kidding me? Homie ruined it for us. We are absolutely just massacring these guys. Let me go stance again, please. Block. Just literally chase them out of the neighborhood, Trev. What the fudge, Trev? Come on. It didn't let me immediately counter him there. Usually you, you parry once and then you get to hit him back. It didn't let me hit him back. He had a second attack. We almost got ghost again, but it's fine. Our combat's really starting to come together. I'm, I'm starting to get more confident with it. It feels good. You know. You saved your town. Now. We help Lord Shimura save our island. We are not soldiers. Who killed these Mongols? Who stood against the siege? Who saved Yarikawa? We did. My man. You can't just stay here and wait for the Mongols to try again. You say you are not soldiers. You are warriors. We can defeat the invaders and save our home. But only if we stand together. That was an incredible battle scene. One of the coolest battle scenes I've had in a, in a video game. Seriously, like that was inc just so cool. Inspiring. Inspiring the next generation, the ghost of Yarikawa. We're forming our own little army here. Khan's got to know we're coming. Your friend defeated one of my best generals. My men have started to believe he's invincible. You will prove them wrong. I don't care about the reward for Jin's head. Have you stopped caring for your loyal straw hats? Jin is the best swordsman on the island. My men can't kill him. There are many ways to eliminate a foe. Find another. What if we didn't have to kill him? You must be Goro. Uh, we must all be someone. Who must you be? Lord Sakai. Ah, the samurai are all dead. I'm very much alive, but my patience is dying. <laughs> Lord Shimura asks that you repay your debt to him. He's alive? <laughs> what does he want? to deliver a message to the mainland. Uh, I charged a lot for that trip, even before the Mongol blockade. You owe my master a debt. This will repay it. Then I have no choice. He's down. After Komoda Beach, I thought my debt to Lord Shimura was erased. That's why I was drinking. To celebrate your escape? To mourn the samurai. Those warriors died protecting men like me. Hmm? They swore to defend everyone on Tsushima. Even you, Goro. 
I don't know if I can repay their sacrifice. My master wouldn't ask for your help if he expected you to fail. Huh. This dude is sloshed. Can't even take ten steps home. without Come in. taking another hmm. swig. Getting past that Mongol blockade won't be easy. Do you have Lord Shimura's message? He has it. At his camp on the Akashima coast. Ah. I can work with that. One of my boats is hidden near Fort Mitodake. This map shows where I'll wait on the forest road. Map leading Goro's hidden smuggling boat. Open up, Goro! We're not leaving until you pay us what you owe. Shit. I'll deal with them. Get moving. I didn't call for Ronin. Uh, my lord. What's your business with Goro? Private. We'll... We'll be back. I don't know if I like that. Seems like Goro might be in a little bit of trouble. Might have to have to help him out or settle his debt. So we want to go meet Lord Shimoda at his old hunting camp now. One thing I am going to do is we are going to talk to this trapper here. We are going to upgrade our, hallucin our hallucination dart upgrade. I, I don't know why I can't say that word. Uh, it's going to cost us 10 predator hides and it's going to increase it to three. So we're going to be able to hold three at a time. Uh, that's going to be pretty good. I really want to get the next arrow upgrade. That's going to cost us 20, so we, we could have got that, but it's all right. I just really like those Goodbye. hallucination darts, and I feel like anytime we an see the plants, if we can those. carry more and take more with us, that's a good idea. So we're going to go ahead and meet, uh, meet our uncle back at his camp. Well, what is that? All the way over here. That's where it is. All right. I'm going to say let's, uh, let's fast travel to this fox den over here, get at least halfway there, and... Uh, We'll go the rest of the way on horseback. I found Goro in Umugi Cove. Was he drunk? Not anymore. He will fulfill his debt to you and sail for the mainland. He may be unsavory, but few know the sea like Goro. Will these men deliver your message? Precisely. Kotaro and Jiro are loyal and courageous. I will petition the Shogun for reinforcements. Goro is ready. He will meet us nearby, then lead us to his boat. We will ride when the time is right. Take this moment to prepare for battle. Oof. Yes, uncle. It is time. To your horses, men. We are ready, my lord. Stay alert and keep watch for our smuggler. I'm a little bit worried about what, about like trusting a drunk smuggler with this task. I don't I don't know if he's the best Kill. man for the job, but let's hope that he can get it done. You know, like like Uncle said. When you want to ask me something. Nobody knows the seas like him, so. I'm curious how you met Goro. I caught him selling Chinese silk forbidden by Shogun decree. I burned his stock and let him go. He could have been flogged. But you saw a better path. A skilled sailor can be a valuable asset. The Mongols have many ships. Can Goro evade them all? He has no choice. What will we do if they catch us, my lord? Do not fear death, Kotaro. Live with courage. And never forget the people you fight to protect. Lord Shimura! Goro, where is your boat? This way. I'm happy you're alive, my lord. Thank you for agreeing Are to you? settle your debt. Uh, I'll do my best. But I fear the Mongols will sink me before I leave the coastline. There are too many eyes watching the water. Perhaps we can direct their attention elsewhere. A distraction. I like the sound of that. Dismount. We walk from here. Fort Mitodake. My father took that stronghold from Clan Yarikawa. Now the Mongols have it. Imagine their surprise when two samurai take it back from them. If we make enough noise inside the fort, mm. the Mongol ship crews will look to it instead of the water. And he can sneak by. Goro, we will draw the enemy's attention to the fort. Sail when you hear the fighting. My lord, 
You will be killed. Your only concern is delivering my message. Horses might give us away. We will go on foot, Lord Sakai. Sounds like a simple enough plan. Definitely puts us in danger, but we're no stranger to that. Let's get after it. Man, he's gonna... He's gonna cross to the mainland and that? I... Phew. Mongol armies are formidable, but our attack will catch them off guard. I don't know if Let's I'd be pray that holds down true that. in the fort. They outnumber us. But they cannot attack all at once. How long can we keep the element of surprise? Only until we see the enemy. Then, we strike. So he wants to do this the old-fashioned, super honorable way. Mongols ahead. We could avoid them. Turn your back on a foe, and you will die with a sword stuck in it. Alright. I mean, we just gotta do what we gotta do, man. We're gonna go for some chain assassinations here. Beautiful work. This guy fell down, turned around, and ran. I'm ready, Uncle. Kill their strongest first. Take this big boy down. Well done. Gonna go to our wind stance here. Oof. I hate the sweeping ones. Honestly, the sweeping ones, even if you evade, it's nearly impossible to actually evade it. Nicely done. Should be able to melt right through him. So push forward. That's the he's last down of and he's down. Forward through that gate. Alright. I am proud to fight beside you, Jeep. See how the enemy fear you. You are a true warrior. I'm a Thanks, ghost. Uncle. Where's Maybe. everyone at? Watch us. Take cover. We have to get through that gate. Yo, this is insane. How do I get up there? What do I even do? Wreak havoc on the fort! We need the Mongol ships to focus here! All right, Mongol. let's go! Goodness gracious! Just gonna have to focus some one on one on one here, man. Just one one guy at a time. I don't like all the can archers, dude, I can't I can't do anything when they're just constantly peppering you with shots. He's down. What a shot. Probably don't need to waste our arrows. We'll probably take these guys down up close and personal. Nicely done. Pick some more ammo up. Keep pushing this way. We have their full attention now. Woo. Get off me, you stupid nut! Nobody likes you. Ooh. What's up, fella? We got my wind stance here. Are you kidding me, man? The guys that just sit at a distance and just pepper you—it's—it's it's impossible. Cut that one up. We're gonna go get him. Here you go. Here we go. What is that? Oh my god! That is new Fight to the tower, That's like a mortar of arrows. Okay. Try to lure him into it, maybe? I mean, it, it kind of worked there for a second. I got you up. We're gonna keep moving though. Watch out! Watch out for that nonsense. Gotta watch out for the the big boys. I'm gonna take this guy on for now, I guess. Get up out of that space. There we go. He's down. Now we're gonna take on. Where's the big fella? Get me out of here! Come on, get him! Let's go! That was sick. You 
battle him inside the zone for a little bit and then get out the last minute. It's perfect. Ooh, took a little bit of damage there, but we're okay. I'm gonna keep on pushing here. I really don't even feel bad if you want me to be honest. I hate these stupid little things. Take him down. Please give me your hides. We have hides here. More Mongols! More fellas in here. One, two, three, you're done, son! Four, five, six. Eat a bag of dicks! We pick up our ammo, we pick up this stuff. Get inside, grab these supplies, alright. He's already down, I'm swinging at nothing. Where's our objective? Continuing on this way, I'm assuming. We probably could stop and loot a little bit more. Whoop. Right in the face. They're impossible to hit. The, the like auto aim just doesn't even lock onto them when you're when you're swinging your sword. Good, good parry there, Trev. This guy's. This guy's got moves. This guy's, he's got big armor, but he's quick. Gonna have to focus on the parries. Oh, that's a leader, that's why. Six more of those, we're gonna be able to get our moon stance. Nicely done. Just keep on going here. They're predicting the path we're gonna take, dude. They're doing a pretty good job of it, too. Go right, go left. Never let them know where you're going. 1v1, you're done, son. Got him. Now we take the watch up. All right, watcha. I'm gonna go grab this watcha. Am I gonna be able to be able to take this thing for myself? There is Goro's boat. We bought them time, but not enough. The Mongols have seen them. Let's shoot their boats. And their attack ships are faster. Our men are defenseless. No. We've got a watcher. have us. We have a watcher. <laughs> a weapon of the enemy. Watcher. Not samurai. Saving our people is all that matters. You know how to fire this. I'll learn. Destroy the Mongol ships. Leave the guards to me. Uncle. We will not die here, my boy. Nice. So he is kind of starting to come around. That's honestly what the I was most worried about. Parties. Don't let their boats reach Goro. I don't know how. It's working. Nice. The Mongol ships are in flames. Don't let up. Goro wants to run them. Okay. I was gonna say I don't know how far we have to lead this, but it looks like it's not. It's not too bad. And it seems as if we have unlimited ammo, which makes things a, a wee bit easier. Can I take on the, the big big boats? Archers on the shore. Don't slow down, Goro. Take down the archers here. Nicely done. That boat through there. You got this, Goro! Looks like we can shoot their ships. Looks like they might have explosives on the top deck of their ships. Yeah, oh yeah. That's one down, two down. This is gonna be the third one down. We got one out here. Nicely done. Looks like they didn't think ahead on this, ships huh? On the way. Hold on, Goro. Don't want to hit Goro here, so we got to make sure we shoot behind him and don't drag in front of him. You made it, Goro. Bring us the Shogun's help. We did it. I knew we would. You continue to prove the Mongols are not unstoppable. You taught me to fight. I couldn't disappoint you. And you never have. I am proud of the warrior. The man you have become. Jin, my message to the Shogun included an announcement. 
I wish to formally adopt you as my son. Oh. Uncle. In my heart, you have always been the heir to my legacy. When this war ends, we will make it official. One day, our people will look to you as their leader. That brings a tear to my eye. You will become their honorable Jito, backed by all the power of the Shogun. I hope I can serve them as well as you have. I know you will. We must finish our preparations while we wait for the Shogun's reinforcements. What are your orders? Finish your preparations, and I will see to mine. When you're ready, meet me at our staging camp in Kubala. Then we will retake my castle from Kotun Khan and save our home. As father and son, the Shogun himself will celebrate our victory. We will meet again soon. Until then, travel safely. Wow. Dude, that's pretty legit. I was really worried that he wasn't going to be cool with us, but he, he obviously turned over a new leaf right there, and obviously he's got a lot of confidence and faith in us and what we're able to do if he's willing to, to adopt us. Our legend's growing. We're going to unlock our final throwable here, I believe. The Hero of Tsushima. Max health has been increased. We're also going to get the black powder bomb now. If I pack the Mongols' black powder into a clay pot, I can set it aflame. All right. as a weapon. Basically like a little mini grenade. We've got five upgrade points. I've got to go through and decide what we're going to do. I'm not sure what we're going to do with that yet. Preparations are complete for our battle to reclaim Castle Shimura and defeat Koden Khan. Should speak with my uncle at his staging camp and see if he's ready to launch the attack. So we're all good to go. We're going to go take on the Koten Khan. And I'll see you guys there in the next episode.